Hello, welcome to our back garden at Dreamies. Uh, today I'm going to show you one of our new templates uh, which Hayley has designed. It's called the Curved Shutter. This is what you get printed off when you template and also the bits for the matting and layering. So what you need to do is actually cut this out and use that as your template. So then you draw around that, marking all the, all the grey bits off because that's what we're going to cut out. And then use that to draw around your card. Now I've already cut this. What you need to do is cut from the end of, of there to that end. The lines are marked on the original template, which then will allow you to cut and fold. And also the score lines on the template are, are the dotted lines, obviously. The solid ones are, are the cut ones. Okay. Now also, what I've done already previously, I've printed out the, the papers that I'm going to use today, which are from the Dreamist CD, uh, the boutique. So I've done a sheet of shoes, the dress sheet, and the back of paper, which then cut out all the matting and layering. You need three of those if you're going to do the mat it on each one. So you need three of those, two of the longer ones, and eight of the small ones. But that is left entirely up to you. If you don't want to do that, then that's fine. You've just got that option, that's all. So then what I did, I've cut out the template in the card that I wanted to use and I've put these on already so that you can just see me doing the other three, one of each shape. I'm not sure that that's the right way. So I'll just mat a layer up to there. And a little one. It does make quite a a nice stunning card when it's when it's finished with all the matting and layering. Obviously you can put your, your mirror card or anything like that on it. There we go. I'm just that one on top of there. Same as I said, I've cut a dress out from the Dreamers Boutique CD. Put sticky foam pads on the back. Just to decorate the centre part. And I'll have the little shoes on and the other one. I just did a, a sentiment sheet which I've picked, I've picked um, the prop one off of that because that's all in at the moment, the young ones. I'm just going to put that on there, just give it a bit of a, a wiggle there. Obviously you can put more across the top and across the bottom, depends what you think, but that is the card finished. <laughs> 